from Daily Forex, this is Chris taking a look at the dollar yen and the Aussie dollar pairs. You can see that the dollar yen has fallen a bit during the trading session here on um, Tuesday, filling the gap. And I think the next couple of days, we're just going to hang around in this area because, quite frankly, we've got July 4th and we've got the jobs number. The jobs number coming out on Friday. So I think the next couple of days will be quiet, but there are a couple levels that you need to be aware of. Uh, one would be a break above these candle, uh, these long wicks here at about 108.60. A break down below this hammer here from Friday opens up the door to lower pricing. If we break this area, I think we could go to this breakdown candle here at about 109.70. Uh, we'll probably go to the lows here on a breakdown and then eventually break even further. I don't think we're going to see that between now and non-farm payroll, though. This pair does tend to be very sensitive to that announcement the aussie has rallied but you can see it's given back quite a bit of those gains i mean this was a horrible candlestick on monday rba chose not to cut rates and that gave it a little bit of a boost but you can see we've pulled back quite nicely from 0.7 so i think we may see a little bit of a drift lower every 50 pips support comes into play if we do break 70 60 then we can go higher of the longer term